crazy pixel. There's something interesting about a human creating a relationship with an android that typically catches my attention. I enjoy how right from the beginning you question the feelings of the android and then slowly realize that perhaps maybe the human is more robotic than the android or something like that you get the idea. Anyway, following characters through these situations and other rather adult emotions relating to human connections is expressed in the Ratty Art developed visual novel which happens to strike all the right chords for me. This is Noisy Pixel's preview for Synergia. Written by Lynn Carmella. Synergia takes place in a world full of advanced technology where androids are a normal household item. The story revolves around Scylla, a veteran cop who comes off as pretty feisty. Her work life isn't going well due to her inability to truly connect with humans. However, it doesn't end there since she can't even connect with her household android, Elaine, who does act similar to a human. So she decides to delete her personality, little by little. Scylla often questions her actions but is reassured by Elaine that she is doing nothing wrong. However, Elaine ends up malfunctioning and Scylla ends up replacing her with a new android named Mara. Even though she feels bad about replacing her old house droid, she ends up growing quite fond of Mara and this leads to her opening up a little. During this time, a corporation called Velta Labs finds out about Mara's existence and is interested in using her as a key part of their plans. The demo of Synergia only introduces Scylla and focuses on her backstory. We sadly only get to see a brief glimpse of Mara and therefore it is not clear what her personality is like at the time or how they'll get along in the future. So far I really enjoyed the writing and Scylla comes off as a hard working woman who doesn't give up after hardships. The writing also makes it clear how hard Scylla is on herself, especially when she makes a mistake. That being said, my impression of the story so far is that it thematizes sensitive topics since Scylla often questions herself and deals with situations alone as if they are her own cross to bear. During the game players can make choices but at this time I'm not really sure how they will affect the narrative of the game in the later hours. But I'm still curious to see. The artwork is really unique in Synergia, which I was immediately drawn to. Some CGs stand out really well and are stunning, but I feel like the quality differs from scene to scene. I found that the close-up illustrations are beautiful, such as when only an eye is shown, and I thought that the backgrounds looked amazing paired with the game's vibrant color palette. Additionally, the soundtrack is so good and atmospheric, which really fit the cyberpunk theme. Ultimately, while the soundtrack was pleasant to listen to, I felt that the game's immersion would benefit from some voice dialogue. Synergia easily stands out with its adult themes of dealing with life and learning to connect with those around you. The game's atmospheric cyberpunk look goes great with the overall tone of the story. The relationship between Scylla and Mara is going to be crucial to what makes this game truly great in the long run. How their friendship evolves over the course of the story will be what keep players interested in the later hours, but I'll happily add this title to my watch list. Synergia is coming to PC later in 2019. Thank you for watching. Please read the full preview at NoisyPixel.net. NoisyPixel is run by a group of gamers who work hard to deliver news, reviews, previews, and more. Please subscribe to keep up with all our future content.